Hello everybody! Welcome back to the second part of this lesson. In this part, we will continue to learn about the passive voice. Are you ready? Let's do this! We use the passive when we do not know who made the actions. For example, my car was stolen. We also use it when the focus is the action, not the doers. For example, I will be picked up at the airport by my uncle. Let's focus on the passive voice of the present simple tense. Let's look at the structures. The affirmative form. Subject plus am, is, are, plus the past participle, plus by object. For example, this sweater is made in China by someone. And the negative form. Subject plus am, is, are, plus not, plus past participle, plus by object. For example, sandwiches aren't made here by someone. And the interrogative form. Am, is, are, plus subject, plus past participle, plus by object. And we can answer them Yes, subject, am, is, are, or no, subject, am, is, are, not. For example, are the cookies made by your mum? Yes, they are. And now, let's look at how to convert from active voice to passive voice. Rewriting active sentences into passive, we must remember a few important details. Can you guys remember? Let's take a look. 1. The object of the active sentence becomes the subject of the passive sentence. 2. The verb is changed to am, is, are, plus past participle. And three, the subject of the active sentence becomes the object of the passive voice or is dropped. Let's look at an example sentence. I write a letter. Now, let's convert this into a passive sentence together. First, the object, a letter, will become the subject in the passive voice sentence. And two, the verb write is changed to is written. And this gives us the passive voice, a letter is written by me. You can add by me at the end of the sentence or you can drop it. So. Have you got a better understanding of the passive voice in the present simple? Let's look at those forms again. Subject plus verb plus object is changed to object plus is, am, are plus the past participle plus by subject. Let's practice with some more sentences. Active voice. The bones in the skeletal system support all the body organs. Passive voice. All the body organs are supported by the bones in the skeletal system. Active voice. 
humans only produce emotional tears. Passive voice. Emotional tears are produced by humans only. Active voice. About seven octillion make up your body. Passive voice. Your body is made up of about seven octillion. Well done, everybody. That's everything for our grammar lesson today. Did you have fun? Perfect. Remember, keep reviewing, keep doing your exercises, and improving your grammar every day. See you in the next lesson.